Hi, my friends. So today I'm sharing another one of my older sketchbooks with you guys. Hope it can inspire you. All right. So this is that first page. And as I did before, a lot of florals, a few landscapes. But as you can see here, I was really wanting to hone in on that iris, trying to do lighter versions. Again, <laughs> lighter versions, darker versions, different purples and trying to figure out that. And then here we did some type of poppies. I think this was a Jenna Rainey video. Um, some peonies and some roses, I guess. That's like a little coral guy, kind of weird. This rose is interesting. Definitely didn't turn out like I wanted it to, but that's okay. This monochromatic painting was cool. Another Jenna Rainey video, and I just kept going with the palm trees. Really love those palm trees, really fun. Trying to do some Hawaiian mountains where I used to live don't love that one, but that's okay. This one, Emma Fave, loved that one. Um, oh yeah, doing some more roses. That was really early on. These little guys are so cute. Roses are hard, guys, if you have a struggle. I think this one was from Clarice Gnomes, is her name, one on the left there. More poppies, just kind of practicing out all the things, some cherry blossoms. I loved doing these oranges more of those little porcupines. And those flowers, I really liked how those turned out. Um, Wisteria, wasn't a fan of how it turned out, but it was great practice. Lots of leaves, guys. Practice leaves, if you wanna get better at something, it's great for your fine motor skills. I love to use lots of bright colors, and so I chose tutorials that reflected those colors. This one, um, Ellen Creamy Trent, also a great watercolorist. Thanks for watching, guys. Now pick up your paintbrush.